So criminal law is a compulsory paper and you'd usually take it in the first year of the degree. And I love teaching it because the factual situations that we deal with in criminal law, they're pretty gory. So we're looking at homicide, sexual offences, violent offences, that sort of thing. But because the facts are immediately understandable by everybody, that means we can get on pretty quickly into some interesting critical evaluation of the law and through the law, thought about human relations as well. So taking some examples from the law of sexual offences, the really important question there is what do we mean by consent, or more importantly perhaps, lack of consent? For the offence of rape to be committed, we need a complainant who is not consenting to the sexual intercourse. So what do we do in a case where the victim says, or the alleged victim says, that she only consented because she was drunk, and had she been sober, she wouldn't have consented. What do we do with that as a matter of law? Should that mean that 